The Shenandoah Valley Produce Auction has been selling local flowers and produce in wholesale bulk lots since 2005. Whether you're a home gardener with some extra produce or a professional grower with 5 to 10 acres, your produce is welcome at the auction, where it is sold to the highest bidder. And by providing a central purchasing site, the auction helps commercial buyers find a consistent source of quality local produce. Other than the farmer's market one or two days a week, they didn't know where to get fresh local produce. Uh, but with the auction coming along and then a lot more roadside stands and farm markets and even the independent grocery stores coming here and buying and then advertising it in their store as fresh local produce. And the customer can tell the difference. Third generation grower Charlie Martin has been farming since 1957. He grows produce in the summer to supplement his livestock and poultry income. He's been with the auction since it started and likes the fact that he doesn't have to do the selling himself. When the auction come in to existence, I soon seen that. The best thing about it is I didn't have to hear anybody complain that I was charging them too much. Because they raised their hand, I want that produce. And so I didn't make them bid. So that's what I really like about the produce auction. The Shenandoah produce market has grown every year and now has a large permanent building in Dayton, Virginia, with plenty of parking. Heatwell says the auction eliminates the middleman by facilitating a transaction between growers and buyers, both large and small. The auction house receives a 10% fee from each sale and anyone can purchase the produce. Restaurants, food service companies, farmers markets, farm stands, and individuals are all customers. In addition to giving the local produce industry a needed boost, Heatwall says the auction has a strong relationship with the local food bank. If somebody saw someone buy some produce here and donate it to the food bank, and uh, that business person said, well, hey, I'd love to do the same thing, but I can't be here at the auction all the time. And he was wondering if he could give a donation to the food bank in order to buy produce for here. So we got with the Blue Ridge Area Food Bank and set up a program and anyone can donate money to the Blue Ridge Area Food Bank that will go for purchasing local produce. So uh, last year we sent over 100,000 pounds of produce to the Blue Ridge Area Food Bank through that program. Martin says if a grower sells regularly, packages consistently, and all the produce is good quality, the auction is a great market. I never have to worry Oh, I got an overabundance. Uh, I went to the farmer's market. I couldn't sell it. Oh, I can't keep it over the weekend. If I bring it here, it's sold. We strive here uh, to sell the best and eat the rest. The auction is open Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays throughout the summer. More than a million dollars worth of produce is sold through the auction each growing season, and smaller growers have a great place to market their crops. In Rockingham County, this is Dave Miller.